Yo, what's up YouTube, JP here, just bringing you my latest training updates. I'm currently four weeks out from competing at the IPF Worlds um, and had a really good training week over the last few days. So um, you're taking a look at me uh, benching here, seven to five on this day, I was 92 kilo. Um, this week marked the end of my small of junior block, which I was running. Um, so this is the seven set of five session that you're seeing here and, and I'll show you the, uh, the remaining sessions as we go through. Um, I had a really good week in training, lots of volume, uh, as you can imagine, four weeks out. So just pounding myself with volume, smashing myself into the ground, lots and lots of work being done. Here you see me doing some lighter stuff, some lighter deads, this is only 195. For some triples, I like to do a light deadlift day two days before my main deadlift day. So you're going to see my main deadlift day in a couple of clips time. So just na nailing some technique in here. Also did some heavier front squats that day, which you're going to see up next, 110 for sixes, which pretty good standard for where I'm at now, and it moved really well. So really happy with this. Um, here you see me training out of Obsidian Strength, the newest strength and powerlifting club in Melbourne. So exciting. We got a new we got a new member, my best friend Megan. She had a good session the other day. You're going to see her deadlifting 120 kilos here. Coming, she doesn't coming, really have coming. much formal strength training, so I think she's got a lot of potential there. Um, and you're going to see here eight sets of four on the bench. This is with 98 kilo. So this is week three of the Smolov program. I'm running off a training max of 122 and a half, which is 10 kilos above my actual max. And I got through the whole whole week, which I was really happy about. Trying to with my mate Christu. He's here doing some synchronized benching. That wrist wrap has been pissing me off for the last few weeks. It just comes undone pretty much every session. Um, I've got, I do have a new fresh pair of wrist wraps, which I've been using for the last couple of days. And you can see us we're pretty happy with ourselves there. Yes, I do have a new fresh pair of THP wrist wraps, which I'm going to start using. Now that these ones are blowing themselves apart. A little bit wobbly there. Um, so yeah, hit a 252.5 kilo or 556 five, pound single and was really disappointed with how this one this one went just knocked it forward fell over wasn't as clean as it could have been and i made the same mistake last week which is the annoying part that i didn't really learn from my lessons i'm gonna have to really make a big note of that this week to, to clean it up here you see my last set i did five fives at 213 after that top set and this was my much this was much better it was my best set i was i was actually really happy with this i just didn't make my heavier stuff look like this and i'll be happy you can see I'm happy there. Um, some high bar stuff as well because big quads, squat, big weights. I do all my beltless, I do all my, sorry, high bar and front squat stuff beltless. This is 144. For some fives. And that brought me into my final day in the small of program, which was 10 triples at 104, all touch and go. I run the whole block touch and go. I haven't paused a single rep. And that didn't really bother me because I had testing yesterday, which we're going to see up in a second. Here you see some light squats. I do a real similar thing with my squats. I like to have a light day. This is only 167.5 for some triples. I have a light day before my main heavy squat session, which will be today. And in that um, lighter squat session, I do some conventional deadlifts, which you're going to see in a minute. I also train with my friend, Alex, which you see him in the background just warming up there. He's also coming to Finland with me. He's in 83 kilo junior division. Uh, strong guy, and we get the opportunity to train together every now and again, which is always a pleasure. So shout out to you, Alex. I know you're watching. Um, so hit some conventional deads after this. I borrowed his belt. Use my straps. If you watch my hook grip video, which I hope you have, you'll know that I absolutely love using straps for rep work. These are really lazy. I wasn't really happy with these, but not a problem. And then I came into my testing day. You're going to see that in a second. I did 112 and a half for an equal PB, followed by 115, followed by 117 kilos, which was a five kilo PB. So that was really sticky and I was a little bit disheartened. And then the 115 moved really well, and then 117 moved just as well. And then I unfortunately missed 120. 
but really happy it showed that small have kind of paid off. I didn't really do any pause work, like I said, during the whole, like the, over the last four weeks, and it didn't really bother me. You can see I'm happy there. So this is the 117, back that up with some close group sets of 10, just to squeeze in some volume. If you like what you see, make sure you like the video, subscribe if you haven't already. Comment with any questions if you have any, or any suggestions as to what you want to see from me over the next few weeks. I've got some fresh videos coming up for you pretty soon, so make sure you stay tuned and you've subscribed so you don't miss out. Thanks for your time. Catch you later. JP out. Joey, come back! How the fuck did you get a bicycle? Holy crap. I'm running like a bicycle person. Oh my god.